So there is no true right join in itself, just like there's no true left join, but we can use VLOOKUP and we can leverage the fact that right and left joins are just mirror images of each other. So in that case, with a right join, we just start with the contents of the right table. I'm going to paste them in right over here. And then just so they the columns end up in the same order, I'm going to move the last two columns to the right. So I'm just leaving space here to join in the name column, but we're going to be joining them in using the right ID indices. So I'll go ahead and label that name. And then we just perform a left join with VLOOKUP. And it's, remember, it's not a true left join. So our lookup value is going to be that Muppet ID. Our table that we're going to look up in is going to be our left table. We'll hit F4 and lock it down. We want to extract from second column. And then we'll, our last input is false because we want an exact match. And when we copy it down, notice that we get an error here in the last one. That's because Muppet ID 8 in the right table doesn't have a match in the left table. So that's our little hack to perform a right join in Excel. Also keep in mind that in Excel there is a Power Query option which you could access through data and get data. And in Power Query you would have a true left and a true right join. So hope that helps.